So we'll get into that Speaking later. Speaking of shapes, actually. We oh. could get that into it. Na- we could get into it now. It's up to you. We might as well get into it now. All you right. mentioned the word shapes. We've got to get into it. Okay. We've got to we rank do. the flavours They are of very shapes. important. Absolutely, they're important. Big part of the Australian yeah. culture. And I want to go shapes. back into Arnott's just normal biscuits. So I'm going to write this down so I don't forget. Arnott's biscuits ranking. Yep. But before we get into that, yep. I want to rank the shapes. The shapes. They are important. They Obviously, are. Obviously, we've got the original ones. So we've got your barbecue, your bacon and cheese. Your pizza, I think. Your pizza is an original. Chicken crimpy. Yeah, they maybe, maybe the savoury yeah. and the cheddar. The savoury, I feel like I don't rate them. They're, they're ordinary. They're, bit, they're just they're very bland. So we'll start with barbecue. In my opinion, highly overrated. I, I wouldn't say... I'd say they're perfectly rated because... Like, I'm sorry to disagree with you here, but, like, they are a staple. Like... You, you can't go wrong. They are a staple. I will admit I, they are a little bit boring. They are boring because, yep. like, I see... They would be the most highly purchased shapes. Yeah, for year. sure. Yeah. They are good, but, jeez, they're overrated. The, yeah, they're, some would say that. I would. But uh, there are better flavours out there. Tommy, yes or no? Overrated, no. Which one? For barbecue. barbecue shapes. They've got to be overrated. A little bit. A little bit. Right, so Tommy says yeah. a little bit overrated. Yeah. I'll, I'll, like a... Yeah, that's fair enough. Like it's fair enough. Yeah, I'd, but in my opinion, they're they're just fine. They're, so would you? What would you give them? I'll give them. How are we ranking them? Are we ranking them? In I like, don't know. We'll just sort of go through our maybe our top few, our bottom few, maybe like like out of ten or I'll, I'll quickly write down so top, middle, and bottom, and yeah, we'll just okay, sort we'll them put, out like that. Yeah, just three tiers. Yeah, yeah. keep I, it simple. Where do you? Ra- I feel like barbecue has to be in the like, in the between middle. middle and top because they are rated highly yeah. and they are decent, but they're yeah, too overrated. So I, I'll put them. Roughly, I'll just, just in between. A, yeah, in between. Yeah, yeah that's I, I don't good. mind that. I'll, I'll what else have we got? We got bacon and cheese. Yeah. So personally, that's one of my favourite flavours. Yeah. <laughs> Come in the uh, pink box. So mm. that they're unreal. They go down well. Pink box is visually appealing. It is. Yeah. The shapes are visually v- vomitable, in my <laughs> opinion. Um. Yeah. So, uh, but what, like, what do you like about it? I just, I really like the the flavour of like they're just good. They're like they're just there's nothing else to say. They they're just taste, good. They taste like, like I love Arnott's. Yeah, I love the business. And geez, they they're a staple of Australian. They culture. do a good job, absolutely. Mm-hmm. But geez, the the bacon and cheese sometimes you, you just can't get behind it, can you? I cannot. No, nah. because nah. sometimes I feel like I really question the due date. The due date. Yeah, you, you know they. You, you know, think they're stale? You, you, know, you, know, you, you give them a few years. So, you know, shapes give themselves a couple of years before they go out of date. And geez, I feel like, look, I don't know how they make them. And clearly, <laughs> do they use real bacon? Do they use real cheese? Because sometimes I feel like I'd the assume, cheese can be I, a little bit unique. Yeah, it, it can be. It's a bit it's too a bit, unique right, that I'd almost visit the bathroom. Oh, I wouldn't wouldn't go that I'd far. Go surely no, you, you don't. No, I'd go there. So where would you rate it from top to bottom? Well, for me, it's very close to the top. That's. Obviously, we both couldn't agree on that one, I don't okay. think, could we? So, I'll write that down. Bacon and cheese for yeah. you. Like, Sorry, but but for me, it's got to be down gotta towards be, the yeah, bottom. Yeah, um, that's fair enough. Like, everyone's yeah, got their own opinions, but... Yeah, we do. I yeah. do feel like I do question the shapes' as due date. Just because... Have you, like, you've had a few bad well, batches over look, your years? maybe visiting the bathroom is a bit concerning due to a biscuit. And maybe it I is. haven't done that. But, geez, the smell of it makes me go there. Yeah, okay. It, the smell is quite pungent. Yeah. You do smell... Like, you open a box of bacon and cheese and you do smell... The odour does yep. uh, say good day. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> um, what other ones? So, we've got nacho cheese. Nacho cheese. Oh, I'm a is big... That, fr- is that an original? I don't... I reckon they m- might have brought that one out just a few years ago. Like, yeah, I wouldn't okay. say it's an original. I yeah, think, Tommy might be checking that one now. Yeah, we'll but when I tell you what, out. they go down well, don't Oh, they? don't they ever. They've got to be top of the top of the top. Absolutely. I'm glad we agree on that one. Yeah, I... Not an original. Mm. Well, yep. they've got to change that. Yeah. Wait, so if it's not an original, can you always buy it? I think so. Like, they've been in the store for a few years right. now, so I wouldn't... And they're a big... They're a crowd favourite, so I don't think they're going anywhere. Yeah, so. because there's there's original, there's limited edition, then yeah. what are those ones called? I don't know. They're just, just there, I suppose. Just, they're just spawned there. Yeah. Well, I'm glad that they're an option, because nacho cheese certainly They're, they're hits, so good. Oh, don't they ever? Yeah. So, and I don't think a lot of people can disagree. No. Nacho just, cheese... And I would almost the say the shape is very it, it's like very it's, appealing. It's like a nice what is it like a jagged It's like a jagged square? Yeah, it's more almost. Yeah, Tommy I'd might say have so. to find that. I feel like we he's a workhorse at the moment trying yeah. to What shape are they? They're more Nacho cheese. Yeah. Cuz I think they're the Yeah, I think they are. 
But and the flavoring, they've they've got a lot of that flavoring, like you know the tomato yeah. flavoring and oh, like yeah. it's, it's and it's good. a good mixture. And they're they're generous with the flavors. They abs- That's probably so, one of the best yeah. ones they do. And I love the little the uh, cardboard box where it says flavor you can see. Yeah, uh, nacho cheese. You can, you can see the flavor. Absolutely. And they are so way. truthful when they say that. Yep. Shape, Tommy? It's like a, it's like a sideways square. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like, yeah. So pretty much yeah, we, square. we know what it is. Yeah. Uh, savory? Savory. I've, no real flavor behind it. No. I feel like I can only say I've ever purchased them once. Yeah. And I don't think I ever will you again. Never will again. They're just because they're such a bland biscuit. We're putting it at the bottom. Yeah, because like you can't like they're not bad. Obviously, the flavour isn't bad because there there isn't much there. Mm. But but the just name so is p- off putting. Savory. savory. It's like what savory? A, a savory biscuit like, to me is flour and water. Yeah. Yeah, that's never going to taste good. No, and it's is it it's is just it, so is it plain. An original? I think it is. I reckon it could be an original. So yeah, they've made a stuff up there, aren't it? Yeah. I do love them. I like, do love them. I would like to know. Like, they they just can't be very popular, I don't think. No. Because just how plain they yeah. are. But Sorry, Tommy. I'm going to have to ask you a question. Can you please list, get all the flavours down? Because I'm struggling to find new flavours. What about um, cheddar cheese? I reckon that could be are a flavour. Are they the yellow? They are yellow, oh, I believe. Oh, no. They're kind of very similar to savoury. Mm. Like, they're very... Yeah. Have you had I'd them once? To, oh, I actually can't really remember, but I feel like... Cheddar cheese wouldn't be great. It's not a like I, it's a, for me. It's very similar to savory. I feel like the the flavor just isn't there. Yeah, they're quite bland. Pretty sure just a very. I think it's just a rectangle shape yeah. as well. Just not much going for. You can them, write it down if you want. Mm. It doesn't matter. Um, so we're we putting it at the bottom. I'd say it's above savory. It's above savory, but very close to the bottom. Yeah. So yeah. we'll say cheddar cheese there. Yeah. Um, we know you love your biscuits. Of I've course. sort of run out of ones that we've thought of. Um, what else is there? I reckon pizza. Well, you've got a, in your bedroom, you've got a stack of them. So if you can, like, you want to talk about that? Okay, I can mention that. So yeah. obviously, uh, it, yeah, in my bedroom, I, not many people would know, but I do have like a, a pyramid made mm. out of shapes boxes. So obviously it's a very unique Piece it is, of furniture. But it's something you take pride in. It, it's something I do take pride in. So it's in. pretty much every flavour that he's seen yeah. uh, stacked on yeah. his wall. Yeah, pretty much. Unopened. I and know, this really gets on me nerves. It does. Every time you come to my house, yeah. it's something you mention. So because, you know, tell us your thoughts about that. I think a that. lot of the viewers will agree with me on this one. Yeah. So he's got every shape's flavour in his bedroom, but it's not opened and it isn't eaten. In no. my opinion, You've got to eat them and then put something heavy in the box yeah. to keep it up there. I, you got to eat. You can't buy them and not test them. Yeah, well, I I do. I normally what I do to overcome that one. I do normally buy two. Buy two of the same. Two of the same. So okay. ones to eat, ones for. Okay. Just because. Yeah. Yeah, I, like I see what you're saying. Hundred yeah. percent agree, but. But as long as you're getting it consumed. Yeah. Because all, all then of, you can say, "Oh, I've tried this yeah, one." Yeah. Obviously, I've tried all yeah. of. So that the, is good. Yeah. You've saved yourself there. Yeah. Yeah, but like obviously it, it can be considered a bit so of a waste of food. Can you memorize what ones are up there? I think I can start. try my best, but uh, obviously it's uh, chicken crimpy. That's one of the originals. I, what do you think? I love them. I'm a pretty big fan. Yeah, I love them. Yeah, um, it's got to be above barbecue. It does. I, I reckon it could be do nearing you the below top. Bacon and cheese. Yeah, definitely below bacon and cheese. All right, so we'll put we'll put it there. Chicken crimpy. It, I'll just say this real quick. Yep. Oh, here we go. A survey. Yeah, yeah, like a, a yeah, a survey and polling, and uh, the winner was chicken crimpy. There so, we go. So a survey from Arnott's a reveals survey. that I chicken know, crimpy is the most I don't popular flavour. I don't know if they can hear you, but I'll repeat what he said. So Arnott's did a survey, and um, for everyone that loves their favourite shapes, flavours obviously, mm-hmm. and chicken crimpy came up first, which is surprising. It is surprising, but it actually. is a very good flavour shape. Yeah, you, like you can't go wrong with it. Yeah. You're never gonna. And there's the mini ones, which are pretty cute. Yeah, the, and then there's the, the big ones, which yeah. obviously, oh, I prefer because quantity over quality. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <That's> my motto. <laughs> um, <laughs> any others? Ah, uh, I reckon there's a few. There'd be a heap more. There's a few more obscure Limited ones. Limited edition. Oh, I've got a... oh, here we go. Pizza. 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 Sorry, Tommy, to cut you off. We've got to rank pizza. Yeah. Pizza's Mediocre. pretty... It's It's probably above barbecue, I'd say. Ooh. I reckon. Just because yep. there's a, you know, a little bit more yeah, going oh, no, for it. Yeah, I can it. have that. Yeah. I can have that. But, that's, but they're not... You wouldn't put them, like, in your top 
yeah. category. No, so, I can have that. Yeah. Can kind have of that. in that middle class area. What is it about them, though? They're just... I feel like they are, they are, they are a lurking biscuit. A lurking I biscuit. I feel like they lurk. Tell they me lurk what you mean by that. Shelf. I feel like they don't get enough attention. Yeah. I feel like they're sort of neglected. <laughs> because all the attention is on barbecue. Yep. And okay. I get jealous. There's a lot of attention on chicken crimpy, but there's a reason for that because they are good. They are good. There's a lot of attention on nacho cheese, I think. Who? What one gets the most attention? It's got to be barbecue. It does. Yeah, like pizza just, flies under the radar. It does, but it's still a good flavor. It's a good but flavor. I'd, ag- I'd agree that barbecue does get a lot. Probably the most attention out of all. Yeah, yeah. I, I do agree. Tommy, next one. Uh, cheddar, uh, chicken crimpy, meat pie. What? Meat pie. I do, I actually, believe it or not, I do recall that one a few years ago. That was a long time ago. The meat pie shape. It was unique, but it did go down quite well, I think. Oh my gosh. Yeah. No, I can't. I actually can't. A meat pie shaped biscuit. Yes. Yeah. The meat pie. (laughs) Fire out. Um... And it was good? It did go down pretty well. Like, I couldn't complain with it. It, it was... <laughs> it's not that funny. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> you reckon it wouldn't be good? No. Okay. I feel like it... Oh, no, I can't wrap my head around it. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm looking it up now. A meat pie shape. So you rated it? I, yeah, like, it wasn't, you know, outstanding. But, you know, I'd put it in the middle yeah. category again. Oh, that's... Oh, so it's in the they were in the shapes because Vegemite ones. Yeah, the Australian range. shape. They're in the Australian yep, shape. That's right. Right, and yep. a limited edition. Lim- so we can't yeah. get them. Now. I don't think they've Thank made an appearance. Goodness. On, yeah, they haven't made an appearance on the shelf for many years. So now, how so. would you rank them? Oh, just in the middle, in I'd the middle. say. Yeah, meat pie. I cannot believe that. Next one, Tommy. Uh, toasty. Oh, is that the I've, triple cheese toasty? I've heard they've been that. Terrible. Was the single worst flavor of shapes I've ever Diabolical. had. Diabolical. <laughs> so the worst. Look, I think if we had fifty pages lined up in the bottom, they'd be on the bottom of the fifty. So page. far down. Like, so it's so far down. It's not even funny that I can't even yeah, fit I, it on the I, page. I, so I think we need to just, just don't even write it. them. Yeah, I'm not even. I'm not even. The worst flavor that. tasted like spew. Okay. It was horrible, and it smelt like it probably too. It did. Yeah. Next it one, was Tommy. Disgusting. Sausage. S- the sausage. sausage. Have you tried? I have. Again, mm. of course. It's um, one that you haven't tried. Probably not. Oh my like, I've, he takes pride in it. Sausage. Where would you write it? That was really good, actually. What shapes were they? In? They were the part of that Australian. Oh, sort yeah. Of, well, I yeah. don't mind that little um, thing they made where yeah. they have the Australian and yeah, I don't it's, mind it's that. a nice shape. So the sausage was good. It was really good, actually. Yeah. Better than a meat pie. Absolutely. Like better it, than barbecue. Yeah, I'd say close to the top of the ranks. To be you honest, reckon? it was pretty better good. Better than pizza. Yeah, better than pizza. Better than chicken crimpy. I reckon so. Better than bacon and cheese. I wouldn't quite go that far. Okay, so a little bit under that. Okay. Exactly, so yeah. we've got the sausage in there. Yep. So that's an interesting call. Well, it I is. feel like I mean the meat pie I actually thought you had sort of taken the piss a bit, but No. That one was fine. That's I can't believe that's even a flavour. But sausage I can and I'm surprised it's that high up. But I don't know, I can't say yeah, anything. I, I haven't tried yeah. it. Next one, Tommy. So veggie might we'll do one more. I yeah. reckon the veggie might one because we could be here for yeah, 50 hours. Yeah, cheese. Yeah. Veggie might and cheese. I, I love because it's a little bit of a game, and I'm a child. Yep. You know, you open the box and you see probably how many? Probably ten, maybe. It's, it varies yeah. because in a box you might get ten tazzies or you might get one. Oh tazzy. yeah, yeah. If you find the tazzy, you're the coolest bloke on the planet. Absolutely. So it does, it, it's a good booster for your pride, oh, isn't, isn't it? Isn't it ever? And you sort of don't want to eat it. I feel like when I pick <laughs> out a tazzy, you sort of want to keep it and frame it. But you obviously got to eat it at the end yeah. of the day. Yeah. Yep. It is a very good flavored shapes. Yeah, Vegemite the Vegemite cheese. cheese is. Probably very, very close to the top of the, my ranks, to be honest. Yeah. It, so, it just, in my opinion, it is above chicken crimpy. Yep, of course. And below nacho cheese. Yep. What about you? I'd agree with would that. Would you say it's above bacon and cheese? I would. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. Good. So, Vegemite and cheese. So, what we've got here is we've disagreed on pretty much just the one, which is the bacon and cheese. The bacon and cheese, and cheese. yeah. You've put a, it at the top, I've put it in between middle bottom. and bottom, but the yep. rest of that we've been pretty... Well, they're not... Really disagreeing, disagreeable topics because they're pretty damn simple. Yeah, and if they're all. You, if let's you think savoury is good, good, then you're not human. If you think, uh, what was the bad one? Triple cheese toasty is good, then you're not human. Yeah, obviously <laughs> everyone's human, so yeah, they will w- probably agree on that. If you don't leave a comment, but um, I don't know how much attention we'll pay to that 